Hey guys, so um, I thought I'd do a sort of update on my blog because I haven't done one in a while and um, I've, as um, you may know I did a video ages ago saying about my exercise regimes and my workouts and stuff and how I was going to start doing them and updating you guys on it. Well, that kind of failed for a while because of the fact that um, when it came to winter I became so lazy and I just had no motivation. And now I'm back on my motivation. I've actually been working out for a week now. And sorry, my hair keeps getting in my face. And, um, wow, I'm just being really happy because I've, I've started on, um, with just my running on my My Co Me Coach app, uh, which is free on, oh, um, it's on Android, Blackberry, and iPhone. So it's really good. I love it. I use it and it caters to what you want. Um, for that's weight loss, fitness, strength, whatever, and then it will cater to your level of ability, like of your health. So if you're not very fit, then it's not going to give you something really hard to start off with. You can choose, and um, I love doing that. Um, I run about 15 to 20 minutes a day with it because that's what it's given me, depending on the day. So I do that five days a week. That's Monday to Friday, and then weekends I have my rest days because you're meant to have rest days. But because weekends are the time I'm away to my boyfriend's most of the time, I don't see what... There's no point in me working out on the weekends. So I put those two as my rest days. Um, I also introduced circuit training into my workout because someone I know... Um, there's I, I, have, I know a few friends who do a lot of working out and they're all guys. No girls seem to give me any tips on fitness. So all these guys I know on Facebook always send me tips on working out. And um, one of them gave me a tip on circuit training and it was off the men's health site and um, it's not that bad even though it's for men it's not too hardcore some of the things I didn't do like there's two sets to this circuit training the first like 10 minutes you do um, your squats then you do your um, I can't remember what it's called where you stick your legs out and then move step back again and then the other leg and then well I do that then I do um, I lie on my back and I have to kick my legs in the air. You know when you hold just your uh, half, hold your bottom up in the air and then you kick in the air. Well, I do that next. Then I do, um, I do actual crunches, which is bicycle crunches. That's the only one I can remember the name of. Oh, the other one's a mountain climber. I do as well. I do a mountain climber, which I really like. But um, you do all of those for forty-five seconds, and then. Once you've done that once, you have a minute break, then you do it um, again for another, each one for 40, oh no wait, let me start that again. So um, for the first, four, you do 45 seconds for each um, uh, exercise and then you have a 15 second break, then you go on to the next one and the same thing again and you do that. And then once you've completed all of them, you get a minute break once you've done the whole set. And then you go on to do it again. And apparently, I think I've been doing it wrong because I think you're only meant to have a one rest, one minute rest, after, and that's only after the first rep, like after the first first set you've done. But I've been doing a minute break every time, so I'm going to try and change that now. But then once you've done that three times, then you move on to the second set, which is pull-ups, you know, chin-ups. And there's chair one that you have to lower yourself down with, like that. Um, Push-ups, obviously. And there's a squatting one where you have to like squat against the wall and sit, sit there for 45 seconds. And they're all 45 seconds long and then you get a 15 second break in between each exercise. Then you go through it. Like, and you have to do these three times for each set, for each load of exercises because it's, it's kind of complicated. But yeah, you do that. It's really intense because you're keeping your heart rate up. And um, it's, it helps burn 5% cat, uh, fat a day. So that's why I do it. But I only manage to get through the first loads. Like, I do each... I do the sets three times like you're meant to in the 45 seconds of that, but I only do the first set. I don't get onto the other exercises because by then it's too hardcore for me. Like, because I think that's for guys, it, they can handle it better than girls. So for me, that's all right. I don't mind because it's still hardcore for me. So I do the running, I do that. I also do yoga now as well. I've introduced yoga into my life which I love because it's making me stretch my muscles more out and it helps me learn to breathe because I have problems with the way I breathe. I don't breathe properly. I like forget to breathe most of the time. It's weird. Like I'll just talk and talk and then I'll be like, oh, I'm really out of breath. I can't breathe. So I have to like breathe in again. It's really weird. But um, yeah, I have a problem with breathing and 
that kind of helps and the flexibility side is brilliant and it's a good way of toning if you don't want to be intense I do this now in the morning and I do it in the evening before I go to bed and um, it makes me really tired I also do weights now as well I do at the moment I'm on three kilogram weights dumbbells for my arms and before I was doing that I was doing shake weights and as you can see my shoulders have actually come a lot more firm up to like here and then down here these are seems to be my problem areas at the minute so I've got to sort those out it's the, the basically the areas I want to sort out really is the um, is my arms and my stomach my abs that's what I wanted to get done you know the crunches to get my stomach flat and my flat my stomach is actually getting flatter I can see like lines forming where you know where you, when it's sculpted you can see how when it's toned that you see those lines and stuff around your stomach yeah I'm getting those and it's not a six pack I'm talking about I'm talking about like I'm not talking that extreme, I'm just talking about um, when you're nicely toned but not toned to the point that you look athletic, basically, if you know what I mean. Um, what else? Um, yeah, I do that, basically. That's that's my workout every day now. Until, and then weekends have my rest days. Um, I think that's it. I'm going to keep trying to talk to you once in a while. There's no point talking to you every day about the same thing. But... Um, I'm going to get on with that now, just to let you guys know, and I've, um, basically I'm doing this so I can lose weight and tone up, that's what I really want to do, and because like you can see I've got a tattoo here, I kind of want to get it followed down to about here, about three quarters sleeve, and I don't care what you say, it's up to me, I, I wanted it for a while now, um, yeah, so I'm trying to lose weight for that, so my arms are like toned enough, so when you get sleeved on it doesn't look really horrible because if you lose weight when you've tattoos it's most likely to deform it's, it's all right for me here because this is quite bony but when there's really like chubby bits like this it's more most likely to go all like warped and stuff but um this is what my arm looks like now i'm just trying to keep a record for myself when i do this you can see like there's a crease there this has got a bit more in actually i've just noticed but it's this bit that's really really bugging me really bugging me like if that goes in with my armpits, so that, that goes really hollow, I'll be really happy. And this bit here. But, you know, I do these exercises, do these exercises, do these exercises, do these exercises. Yeah, so I do these with dumbbells. Um, I used to do the shake weight, but, you know, shake weight only gets you so far. And so far it's got me pretty far. It's got my back up here toned and my neck but you know I want a bit, bit, bit more challenging now because it's too easy so um, that's why I've moved on to 3k weights I'm waiting for my do uh, kettlebell to arrive I'm starting out on kettlebells as well now because that's a full body workout for you for me basically and um, I'm going to add that in as well so I'm going to be doing running weights yoga and kettlebells <laughs> every day and um, hopefully I want to give it maybe two months and I hopefully I'll be toned by then because I really really want to look good because um yeah I'm just sick and tired now of looking unhealthy I'm not unhappy the way I look like I don't feel really bad about myself but sometimes I do have a bit of low self-esteem you know when you wear certain clothes I mean it doesn't matter really if you're really slim sometimes you can wear trousers and things and it makes your um, weight look a bit bigger like you can see things hang over things like that I'm not happy with that sort of thing so I'm trying to lose weight not for the fact that I want to drop a dress size or anything like that I want to lose weight just to tone up I want to be toned whether I'm size 14 or not so even if I've got um, size 14 waist if I'm toned and got a flat stomach I couldn't give a shit you know so um, I think it's um, something I'm really looking forward to doing I really love it every day now and it's such a good way to stimulate my mind because um, a lot of the time I used to get depressed a lot this keeps me sort of energized and less tired and I'm a, in better moods as well um, also I love the fact that when I do it I can see results within like a week like it's not massive results but you you can see there's things like starting to form you can feel things like here like I've only really just noticed this now there's little bits starting to form underneath 
that's fought firmer like you've got layers of fat here still but you can feel the firmness coming through underneath and that's the same with my stomach I've got it's really bad because I've got like quite a layer quite a lot of fat on my stomach even though there's like muscle building underneath that's why I have to keep running to burn that off um, so there's no point doing any sit-ups crunches if you're not going to use cardio to help burn out the fat so um, uh, I love I love my workouts I'm gonna give you an update when um, if I, when I need to so thanks for watching if you're watching this is kind of personal uh, reference you don't have to watch this it's just on here for as a diary sort of thing so um, that's it from me bye